Picture a young lady arriving at Melbourne's best hotel for 10 nights, armed with a new wardrobe and a sense of anticipation. The young lady has been selected to uphold with poise and dignity the image and the spirit of the Moomba Festival. She comes from the Mornington Peninsula, she's the oldest of five children, and she doesn't know what to expect. It all started with my promotional photo and my girlfriend, Gail Gordon. She entered me in the Moomba quest and the rest is history. I was crowned Sun Moomba Queen in the year of the Centenary Cricket Test and the last year of the Queen of the Pacific Quest. It was a very auspicious year. I was to share my reign with the King of Moomba and in 1977 it was a mouse, Mickey in fact. My family started referring to me as Minnie. Controversy surrounded the selection of Mickey Mouse. Blinky Bill, the famous bush koala and his supporters led a protest march, airing their displeasure at the American ring-in, creating a press frenzy. At every turn, Blinky tried to upstage Mickey. Ugly Dave Gray was the court jester and a great sidekick when Mickey got a pie in the eye. Life is for living and Moomba was a living experience for me, with extraordinary people, places, events and spectacles. Moomba helped me develop my confidence and public speaking skills, but it wasn't without its hiccups. When I presented to the winning driver at the trots, I referred to him as a jockey. Over 600,000 people crammed the streets for the parade and there in the crowd was my three-year-old niece, Bianca, waving madly at me 26 years later. The memory of that day is still with her. Boomerangs do come back, as I found out at the Moomba Boomerang Championships. Moomba means let's get together and have fun. I experienced this sailing in a race with Commodore Marshall Hawes and his crew from St Kilda to Williamstown. We got second place and still managed a cold beer and plenty of laughs on the way over. There are so many memories, the Moomba procession, the fireworks, the Birdman rally and the International Motor Show. And guess what? Not only did I get to go to the ABBA concert, I met Frida and Benny, the privileges of being a queen. If it wasn't for my girlfriend Gail, I would never have had this wonderful experience. We shared this journey together and I thank her for that. Moomba was an amazing experience that changed my life. Today I have a husband and children and a busy life running a media business and art gallery. The memories of Moomba will stay with me forever.